Good day, it's Tony Fortunato from the Technology Firm. Guess what? Little tip, little trick, something for you to uh, make your life a little bit easier. When you uh, type in ipconfig at the command prompt and you get a list of all your adapters, uh, most of the time it'll say Ethernet 2, Ethernet 1, local area network 1, 2, 3, very, very undescriptive. If you use something like Wireshark, then the same thing is reflected here where it just says local area connection 2, Ethernet, Ethernet, so on and so on. So how do you fix that? And I've actually had people ask me this in my classes and the fix is pretty easy. If you go to your network and internet connections um, your, or your sharing or your option sharing or your control panel network, it's a bunch of different spots. But at the end of the day, you end up under your network connections and you'll see a list of all your adapters. Well, you can see here I've got my Ethernet 2 is my Ethernet. It's called a killer gigabit Ethernet controller. So I want to rename this. So I'm literally going to just right click, rename, and I'm going to call it killer. Right? Um, my, this one, this ASIX, that's my docking station. So why not call it that? Docking station. Bluetooth is Bluetooth, VMware is VMware, and Wi-Fi is Wi-Fi. So there you go. So now if I come back to my command prompt and I redo my IP config command, you'll see that now it says killer and docking station. Now just a little note here, you see Wireshark did not reflect any of those changes. It will not reflect anything until, the easiest thing to do is just restart it, right? I'm not going to get into the intricacies of Wireshark at this point. It's not worth it. So just restart Wireshark and you'll see it killer and docking station. There we go. So we're good to go. Little tip, little trick. Enjoy your day. Bye for now.